It's about 2.30 in the afternoon on Saturday, July 30th, 2022. I'm Todd Dunn, and today I am in the town of Southwest Harbor, headed toward the seawall section of Acadia National Park. Uh, and we will go into the park in about a mile and a half. And what I'm going to do is just have a look at how many people are there today on a beautiful Saturday afternoon. So we'll see what it looks like here at the end of July 2022. Okay, what I'm going to do today is as we drive into the park, up here in about 100 yards uh, we're going to go over the seawall proper which is the first bit of Acadia National Park and a spot where you can get down to the beach and we'll see how many cars are here then I'm going to loop through the seawall picnic area see how many cars are there I'm not going into the campground because I just uh, I don't think it's appropriate to uh, bother people that are camping in there so anyway here we come to where people park. Nice view out over the ocean from here. A few boats out there. And what do we got? Uh, one, two, three, four, six cars here. There's a spot up here where somebody usually pulls off. Where there may be another car. And yes, there is. So seven cars at the seawall proper. And right here to the right is the entrance to the seawall campground and to the left is the seawall picnic area. So I'm going to drive in and uh, loop through both ends of the picnic area and see how many people are there. It is 2.40 in the afternoon so I don't expect to see very many people uh, picnicking right now. It's a little late. Had I come by around noon it would have been a little different. Here we go into the picnic area. A very short drive right to the edge of the ocean. And this is another natural seawall. And in bad storms, the surf does come over this rock berm we see ahead of us. And it washes rocks onto this road. So what do we have here? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight cars here so we're up to 16 and we'll go into the other end of the picnic area and see how crowded it looks i think most of these people are here today just enjoying the beach although there are some people over there at a picnic table and just loop around trying not to run over anybody A few boats out sailing out there today. Blowing pretty good out there. I really didn't uh, want to go out single-handed and my wife did not want to come. So here is the other part of the picnic area where the main picnic uh, area is in terms of picnic tables and parking. So two cars in the picnic area here at uh, 2 44 p.m. Saturday July 30th 2022 and eight cars at the seawall proper so that brings us up to 27 cars and one more pulling in up there which brings us to 28 now what we're going to do now is drive past the parking areas for the Wonderland Trail and the Ship Harbor Trail which are very popular trails uh, to walk out to the ocean. And in fact, they are among the uh, very few trails that go right out to the ocean beach here in Acadia National Park. So I'm going to stop until we get over near Wonderland. 
Hey, we're just about to the Wonderland uh, Trail, and we're about eight tenths of a mile west of the Seawall Picnic area, and the uh, parking area is just up here. In fact, there's the sign, Wonderland. Yep. So here we go. There are almost always quite a few cars here and people walking to and from cars, kids, that sort of thing, so you always have to go slow. Actually, it doesn't look very crowded right now. So we've got two, three, four, five, thirteen. Eighteen cars here of the uh, 30 cars we had back there. So that's 48 cars. And Ship Harbor is just a quarter mile further down. You can park in one spot and walk both trails. You don't have to move your car. Actually, the crowd isn't bad today. I'm a little surprised. Beautiful Saturday afternoon like this. I've got six here. cars here so that's uh, 57 cars 67 cars at uh, seawall the picnic area and the two trailheads now that's uh, down from what I was seeing last year at this time of year although there have been days when I've seen more cars and uh, the highest I've seen was just a hundred so it's uh, not super crowded today and it's a beautiful time to walk out to the ocean, although it is close to high tide, so there won't be much beach out at the Wonderland Trail. So it's best to walk out there at half tide or less so you really have access to the beach. Okay, we're out of Acadia National Park now. And uh, if you continue this way, another quarter mile, you'll get to the turnoff to go to the Bass Harbor Head Lighthouse. I'm not going to go down there to the lighthouse today because uh, this time of day I expect the parking lot to be completely full and I would just be waiting in line uh, to simply turn around. So I'm going to end this video. Hope you enjoyed uh, seeing just how crowded this part of Acadia National Park is today and the answer is not very. If you did, please enjoy it, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to uh, click that notification bell and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.